I have a problem. I, I've been staying up way too late, not getting up in the morning, not getting my schoolwork done. And I just, I've been in a rough spot. And to add on top of that, I'm taking the ACT in a week, which is basically a test that determines your entire life. So in order to fix my life and to prepare for the ACT the best possible way, I am going to completely reset my life. Oh, it's so bright. Good morning, though. Oh, it's so early. Like, 4.51 right now. I'm still trying to wake up. <laughs> I don't know why, but I literally slept on the floor for the past, like, three days. And trying to sleep in my bed was so much harder. But let's get this day started. So supposedly doing, like, a power stance in the morning for, like, 10 seconds can increase motivation and help wake you up. So, <laughs> 10 seconds is so much longer than I thought. <laughs> okay, that was so random. I was gonna go get sunlight, but it's literally dark outside, so I might have to wait on that one. <laughs> um, supposedly a glass of water can really help in the morning, so. <sighs> the sun literally doesn't set to like 7.40, but I guess I'll enjoy the sunlight I have. Okay, it's really cold. Okay, now time for my workout. And a little bit of a heads up, I've never been able to finish this workout before. So hopefully today's the day. Oh yeah, in my workout, I have to do a backflip and I haven't done a backflip in a little bit. And inside the ceiling's way too small. <laughs> So I'm gonna have to go outside in the dark and do one and hope I don't face plant. <gasps> it's cold. I hate to say this, but I think I'm gonna have to call the workout there. I got basically halfway, but I've been like sick for the past couple weeks, kind of like barely sick. I don't think I might've overworked myself. Those jump squats, man. <laughs> but I guess I'll just go take the cold shower and hopefully that will help. The problem is, is this is still like an hour from when I normally would wake up and I'm basically done with my entire routine. So what now you may ask? Well, I actually have absolutely no idea. Time is legitimately going by so slowly. I actually don't know what to do. Like my brain's telling me to go do my homework and my body's telling me to go back to sleep. Also, I have to practice actually looking at the camera. I'm not used to filming horizontally. I normally film vertically. With all this extra time, I think I'm gonna try meditating. It's not something I necessarily do a lot in my free time. Okay, after making my bed, I did some homework and then had some breakfast and scripture study with my family. And then I had to go to the worst part of the day, school. Yeah, school is pretty boring. <laughs> I just got home not too long ago, but I'm gonna hurry and make a snack, limit myself to like 10 minutes, and then start on schoolwork because I don't want to get distracted by watching like Instagram reels for like an hour. Yeah, okay, buddy, we're not all perfect. And I had to watch something while I ate my snack. Um, but finally, I did go do my homework. And after doing that for a little bit, I then went and played some games with some friends. So it was a pretty hype night. I have to be honest, I was hoping to actually do some ACT prep today. ACT prep today. But I literally have to go to basketball right now, right after I just got back. So I don't think it's going to happen. Which is horrible. I Tomorrow, I'm going to have to focus up. I'm going to have to go crazy tomorrow, okay? Okay, I'm back. And it's 11.04. So it's it's pretty late. So I'm going to wake up at 6 tomorrow. Only because I, I need some sleep. Uh, <laughs> also, I had way too much time this morning. So let's hurry and get ready for bed. Day two, fellas. Day two. I'm significantly way more tired this morning than I was yesterday. <sighs> but I gotta get to it. So then I basically did the same routine this morning as I did yesterday. It worked out pretty good. I went to school. It was pretty boring. Came back, watched an episode with Ezra, 
and then I spent the rest of the day studying for the ACT. I gotta be honest, today didn't go that great either. I didn't get any ACT prep in, which I told myself I was going to. At least I did do my math homework and uh, financial literacy homework, but I also spent like two hours on Instagram. Tomorrow, I'm actually gonna have to clutch up or I, I basically failed this challenge. Okay, good night. Howdy, howdy. It's day three, baby. <laughs> Hi, baby. I live in the shadows. Here's the problem is I'm, I'm working on math homework. It's like 5 11. I have work at 6 30 and I have to make dinner for my family tonight. So. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to study for the ACT again, which is actually so frustrating because it's literally in less than a week. I'm gonna have to grind Saturday. But that marks the end of day three of doing anything except studying for the ACT. Okay, yeah, I literally have zero time. Today, I did math homework, made dinner, worked, and then the day's over. Well, tomorrow, I have to focus up. Good morning. <laughs> I had to wake up early this morning because I went to a, a seminary morning side devotional thing with Bob. It was really good, actually. I got it done it. But now, I actually have to go to school. It's, it's so cold. I should have brought a jacket. I know you guys won't believe this, but I'm actually about to take a practice ACT test. <laughs> practice ACT test. I know, I'm actually gonna study. Okay, uh, <laughs> um, so I got a, a 19. Uh, so not exactly what I was hoping for. Tomorrow, I'm just gonna have to keep retaking this test until I get a decent score. <laughs> morning, morning. Um, today is Saturday. So I slept in probably later than I should have. I think I needed it though. I'm, I'm about to go help with the service project though. So short story, even shorter. I did the service project and then we went and got drinks and stuff after. Just goofed around a lot basically to them. I did take the math ACT section. I got a 14. I'm, I'm actually going to fail the ACT. Hopefully I can go faster. My biggest problem is I'm going too slow. Okay, good night. So I just barely took a full length diagnostic of the ACT, which is basically like the ACT cut in half. Um, and these are my scores. I got a 22 overall. So like, honestly, not terrible, but I'm so terrified for the ACT, but it's okay. I'm, I'm gonna wake up early. I'm gonna get super lucky on the ACT test day and I'm gonna hopefully come out on top. So today is the end of day seven, which means I'm basically done with the challenge. Once I wake up tomorrow, I'm free, I can go back to my regular life. The crazy thing is though, I don't think I am going to go back to my regular life. I think I'll become a better person this week. I, I, I didn't make a huge difference. Sorry, I have a retainer in, so if I, if I can't speak, blame the retainer. I've been more awake and just lively during the day. And then I actually kind of stayed up like with my homework a little bit. So that's always good. And I probably didn't study for as much as the ACT as I wanted to, but I'm honestly not that worried. I, I feel like I'll do great, and if I get a bad score, then, then oh well. Most, most I, I don't know, maybe maybe I'll retake it, but as of right now, I'm just gonna hope I get a decently high score. Well, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you got something from this video to help improve your life, and have a good rest of your day.